Hi, this presentation will outline the requirements for mobile device management, go into some of the key features of Sophos Mobile Control, and also give some likely minimum required capabilities from customers. Now we're all familiar with this concept. The problem exists between the keyboard and chair. Essentially, users can't be trusted, and IT admins have put policies and restrictions in place to keep them under control. This wasn't always easy, but it was helped by the fact that the user operated on a managed network and normally inside an office. But this scenario is changing. And these statistics are an indication of how. You can see the increase in support for mobile devices over just one year. So what do customers need to do? Today it's more likely then that the problem exists between their mobile and a cappuccino. People want to use the latest mobile technology to connect and work everywhere, including accessing business, networks and data. They probably want to do all this on the same device they use for playing games or Facebooking. Customers need to let users work with mobility and flexibility. So what are the things they need to do? Many organisations are already giving people access to corporate email from personal devices. But how safe is that? What if the phone's owner decides that having a PIN or a password on the phone is a hassle, so they're not going to bother using it? If the phone is lost or stolen, then whoever finds it has immediate access to the data. It's also useful to know what a user is doing with their device, how much they use it, and what apps they have installed. And the last thing IT departments need is more to manage and more help desk calls to deal with, so users should be able to manage their mobile devices themselves. Here's how we can do this with Sovos Mobile Control. Users want to be able to read corporate email while away from the office. It means managing their email takes less time, and that can help to make them more productive. Now many organisations are already doing this, but giving email access to one person on their personal device means giving access to everyone. Our mobile control software only allows registered devices to connect to corporate email servers, and sends those settings to that mobile, so they're ready to go. So we've given people the ability to read their work email from their mobile, which is great, but you can't expect them to keep the phone safe. That's why mobile control makes sure that even if a mobile goes missing, the data is secure. You can force the user to have a password or passcode for that device. It's also possible to lock and wipe that mobile, ensuring any corporate data doesn't fall into the wrong hands. Smartphones and tablets are all about apps but you want to have an idea of what's installed on mobiles or maybe even prevent users from installing them. You can do all this with mobile control, as well as deploying policies, installing and removing apps, all from the mobile control console. One of the biggest challenges around management of mobiles is support. A continuous queue of different users wanting different types of devices to be set up, not to mention dealing with the ones that go missing. Mobile control puts the key administration tasks into the hands of the user. They can manage their own phone through an easy self-service portal, which means if it goes missing, they can lock or wipe it too. So Sophos mobile control allows configuration of the phone, things like setting a password or passcode, can address concerns regarding loss and theft through remote lock and wipe, means support for employees' personal devices, but also gives them a self-service portal for managing them, and supports all of the latest operating systems, Apple, Android, and Windows Mobile. 